please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hey now, it's your girl Shanita Nicole and welcome to Do Dream On if you're new and if you're already a dreamer. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Okay, first, I hope y'all don't think I think I can sing for real because I don't. I don't know. I just started doing that and then I just kept it. So, yeah. Okay, anywho, so today I'm going to have, like, this is a really quick tutorial. I'm making a kid's laptop tray, and I'm making this for Madison, and I'm just going to show you really quickly what I do. So, um, you can go ahead and figure out the words that you want to put on there, whatever you want to do. I already have my words, so I'm not going to go through the process of typing it all out and all those different things. So what I did was I played around so I could make sure that it was the wording that I liked. So this is what her laptop tray is going to say. Um, what her lap tray is going to say is going to say, Madison, believe in yourself, be strong, be brave, be fearless, Joshua 19. So this is what I made. I already um, actually printed it out. I mean, I'm going to be um, using holographic um, vinyl. It's permanent vinyl. And I'm actually going to be putting it on her laptop, her lap tray. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Um, so I'm going to show it to you really quickly. I have my transfer tape that I got from Amazon. And then I want to show you how I go ahead and put it on there. So, so here is the holographic permanent vinyl all printed out. And my mom did my nails. Color Street. Shout out to Sassy Sonya. You can contact her about that. But so this looks so pretty. The font, I actually purchased this font. Um, I'll put the font down below or you can ask me if you're interested. I purchased this font and then this font was free. And then these were just fonts from, um, let me put it back over here. So I purchased this font and this font was free from the website. And then these fonts were just inside of the Cricut Design Space. So I went ahead and did that. I'm going to weed it. And then I'm going to put the transfer tape on it. And then I'm going to put it on the um, tray. And yeah, I'm really excited. I think it turned out really, really cute. And I love it. Um, I love the mixture of these particular fonts. So, if you like these particular fonts and want to know what they are, leave a comment. I want to actually get to know you guys and interact with you guys. So, if you're interested, let me know and I will be more than happy to let you know that. Um, yeah. So, this is what I printed out as you already saw. So, let's go ahead and finish this out. So, since I'm redoing it, I just want to let you know what I use. I use vinyl and then I put more because we want to make sure that it cuts all the way through. So that's the base material set and that's the pressure that I use when I use my permanent vinyl. Alright, so we're just going to go here. I'm going to try to save. I try to save as much as my vinyl, even the little scraps, because I could use this for anything. If I mess up, if I need it for something else, I could use this. I try to save as much as possible. Try not to be wasteful. You just never know where you may need a little heart, a star, or another letter, or anything. So... That's a tip that I will provide. Make sure you are saving your actual vinyl because you never know when you may need to use it again. You never know. So. And then I go ahead and look at the reviews. So, I saw the review and I said, come on, honey, take a chance. And I took a chance, I fell in love with it because I used it to remember all my budget binders. So, if you haven't already watched that video. So right here is where I made a mistake. I was 
talking too much and going too fast and you see it kind of like crumbled up so what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to cut it all off and um, reprint that vinyl out so that's what I'm doing here I was trying to fix it it didn't work no big deal so this is how you fix stuff when you make mistakes. I was going way too fast, talking and doing the absolute most. So I'm gonna show you just how you fix it. We're just going to print the bottom part, this part out again, so you can keep that, and then we'll set it on this way. Okay. So it's no big deal. Okay. So I printed out my uh, makeup piece because I wasn't paying attention and I was and I was going too fast. So you have to be very careful, especially with the smaller letters because you don't wanna mess this up. And it's um, permanent vinyl, so it can stick to itself. See that? You have to make sure we are very careful with these things and I keep this type of stuff because <laughs> I'm not perfect and I want you guys to see that we all make mistakes the finished product nobody oh see <laughs> the finished product nobody would have known what happened to it because it's gonna look really really nice this front is a frightful affair so be strong and be fearless. That's the front for that. You got to be very careful. I don't know why I want to spray it. But I don't want to mess this up again. Because I don't want to have to do it again. <laughs> yes, be brave. I was brave and I just did it. I'm corny, so. Oh, here I was trying to salvage the Joshua 19. It was really, really small. And I I could have done it, but it was like a little crooked. So I just took it off because I just was tired of trying to fix it. I, I did kind of fix it, but I deleted that part. But I just took it off. And if I want to reprint it, I could always reprint it later and make it thicker and bigger. So you want to be careful the size of how you're printing so that you can make sure that um, it doesn't cause issues. So it's always bigger. The bigger, the better. In this case. Patience and precision. Alright. We're almost done. So if you stick it with me, yay! Some people probably fast forward it. But if you stick it with me, you my people. You right there, if you sticking with me, please comment stuck like glue. <laughs> if you if you sticking with me right now, go ahead and comment stuck like glue so I can know that you stayed with me during this tedious process. Man, I promise I'm going to scream if I see somebody put stuck like glue. <laughs> I'm I don't care where I am. If I get a notification that somebody type stuck like glue, I'm be like, <sighs> hope I don't scare nobody, but I'm screaming. Okay. Yay. All right. There we go. This, this is how, this is how. I fixed my error, okay? Because we all make them unless you're perfect and there ain't no perfect people. So, I fixed it. Just make sure I get these things on there even. And then, put it on the transfer paper. Hope y'all can see me. I'm sorry, I was so in tune trying to fix it that if you couldn't see me, if I cut it, it off, I apologize. Please forgive me. I was in my zone. Okay. I got the transfer tape from Amazon. So 
left side like that front, it looks like that. Let me get all the little pieces off my fingers so it won't transfer on the transfer tape too and cause all types of problems. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on the transfer tape. If you haven't seen that portion before, you can watch my previous video. I'm going to just measure it out. Make sure I have enough cut off. Now, if it was all in one piece, it would have been a lot easier. I'm peel this transfer tape. Be very careful. See, I'll be going too fast sometimes. And that's my problem. I need to slow down. Okay? That's what I need to do. I need to slow down. I just have 50 million other things that I got to do. So I'm just trying to get the stuff done. But no, you have to slow down if you want your things to turn out right. I mean... So here I decided to cut the Joshua 19 off. Um, I did fix it, but the font, if I were to do it, I would just make it a little bit thicker because it was so thin and I wanted it to look perfect. So I just went ahead and took it off. Over in a bigger font or something later, another day, not today. <laughs> not today. Not gonna happen to happen after all of that. But that's how you would have fixed it. So at least I showed you how it would have been fixed. But I'm not doing that tonight. We're just gonna keep on moving. So the words are on the transfer tape. Now we're going to put it on the lap tray so this is the lap tray and then I'm going to go ahead and put it on top of it I'm going to have to put this down though so I'm going to have to um, prop it up so I can make sure I put it in the correct place and I could have made it bigger I could have made this bigger if I wanted to I could separate it. I could add stuff. So if I want to add hearts or unicorns or whatever, I could add. I could do whatever I want on here. But this is how it is. And I'm going to set it down and put it on. So give me two seconds. Okay. So I have it on the transfer tape. And I think I'm going to put it. Should I put it in the middle? Put it at the top. Should I cut it and separate it? Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Nope. I'm going to just put it in the middle. And if I want to put something at the bottom or around it, I will. Yeah, I'll just put it in the middle. So I have, I use measuring tape. For everything so I measured it before I put it on it so I can see so I can see how um, wide it was and how tall it was but I could have made this bigger So I went ahead and just cut it separate so I can make sure that it was lined up perfectly. I'm going to go ahead and put it on there. Yep, nope, I want it back in the middle. <laughs> I put it on there and then I'm going to go ahead and make sure that it's perfect. You want to make sure that it's nice because it's 
permanent. So you want to make sure that it's right. You want to smooth everything out. Make sure there are no bubbles. Make sure it's smooth and neat. Um, and that when you pull the transfer tape off, that it actually uh, it sticks to the actual um, item that you're trying to stick it to. So that's why I'm just smoothing it now, making sure there's no bubbles. Then look, yep, got to make sure it's all the way in there. Make sure it's good. Because sometimes if you lift it up, you may see a bubble or it may come up. And you want to make sure that it's down. See? So I'm like, let me make sure it's all the way down. Everything is smooth. You don't want to get this far and mess up. So, yep. Super pretty. I've noticed too that when I use my nails, sometimes it appears better. So use those nails, girl. Use whatever you got to get what you want. completed it Madison believe in yourself be strong be brave be fearless and this is on her little this was the transfer tape tape I used but yeah and I got this from um Joann's, I believe, has a little place for the cups. So they could use it for anything. They could put their papers in here. They could put their juice in there. My daughter's not going to eat so in it. So she does her work on it. So it's a few things they could do with it. But thank you so much for your time. You guys be safe out there. Be safe. Be blessed. And come on back. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Bye. Thank you for your time. Please like, share, and subscribe. Bye.